guys my name is Alan Kozik and I'm Croatian through hiker uh, next Monday 15 of March I start my uh, Croatian long distance trail through hike uh, trail is 2250 kilometers long and it's going to be nice adventure for the next 100 to 110 days depending on how much uh, rest I will take um, what is in my backpack I will show you in the next video enjoy hi guys my name is Al and March 15 this year 2021 I start creation long distance trail trail that's connecting most eastern point western point northern point and southern point in Croatia um, so it I expect to be on trail for like hundred between 100 and 110 days depending on how many rest I will have so let's go through my pack so for the trekking poles I'm using uh, Hitor Hike carbon trekking poles just 185 grams so far they were good uh, maybe through some uh, rocky parts of the trail I will use aluminium poles also Hitor Hike just aluminium poles so my backpack my backpack weights my base weight is 6.5 910 grams so a little bit less than seven kilos with supplies uh, with uh, food for like three days and uh, water it's usually around nine kilos so what's in my pack uh, on the front I have one uh, half liter bottle in my left pocket I have uh, Salomon water filter I'm using it for filtering my water and uh, so far it's been great uh, it, it is filtering water much better than the Sawyer Squeeze or uh, I think 20% better flow than Catadin B3 so I'm using Salomon filter for my water filtration so on the on the on the front of my back and on, on my back I have a foam pad very very light in my right waist pocket I have a, my glasses knife pepper spray for the nasty dogs on the trail a uh, little bit of shoe spoon and uh, some basic uh, ointments and uh, alcohol pads uh, also Picardine uh, wipes for those pesky mosquitoes on the trail on my left waist pocket I have this is my Decathlon cap very light buff and my gloves that goes to my left back left pocket okay all right so On this side, I'm having a half liter bo bottle addition for additional water. On the on my right pocket, I have a one and a half liter uh, also one and a half liter bottle for uh, I usually use it uh, on the trail. Uh, as, uh, water for washing and cooking 
And this is small half pet bottle that I use to scoop the water from the from the pond. Yeah. So these are my th these are my ten poles. I have ten of them. I have uh, half of them are titanium and half of them are MSR type and these are titanium they weigh about 8 grams each and I'm using 10 of them to help me set up my Z-Pax Altaplex tent okay this is just a cork bowl for massage in my tent when I'm feeling trash bag. This is a additional pipe that goes through my uh, the tracking pole for a Z-Pax Altaplex tent extension. This is just a rag that I'm washing myself with this one. my first aid kit this is umbrella I'm using it during a heavy pour rain this is very light I think it weights 110 grams my poop kit these are Decathlon waterproof mitts I'm using it to cover my gloves during a heavy rain. My rain jacket. Just additional paper. My rain pants. One piece of uh, hand warmers and uh, one hook. Some uh, plastic bags. I'm usually using them if my feet are wet and cold and I'm putting a new dry socks on the feet and sometimes I'm covering my uh, uh, my feet with the plastic bags okay so inside the bag My tent, this is Z-Pax Altaplex, it is in Z-Pax uh, uh, Cube of Fiber cover, inside I also use uh, mesh to, to, uh, to dry it out on the outside of my uh, pack if uh, my tent is wet and also some polycro sheet, poly polycro ground sheet that I use as additional uh, protection of the bottom of my tent when the when the place is muddy and or wet. Excellent tent weighs just a 450 grams. This is my additional warm layer. This is Kuiu Peloton 97. Very warm and very light for the weight. Usually I'm wearing it in a chilly morning or uh, at the night time. Uh, on myself I have a Decathlon long sleeve shirt with a zip neck. Very light, very breathable. This is my base layer for the all day hiking. Uh, these are my pants. Uh, that I ordered through Aliexpress. Uh, it's pretty good. Uh, they dry very quickly and uh, I'm very satisfied with these pants. Uh, on my feet are Ultra Temps 2. That's my uh, footwear of choice for this trail. Uh, comfortable and uh, 
So far, so good. Some gators to protect me from mud, from small uh, stones getting in my uh, trail runners. So uh, with with these uh, gators, uh, I don't have to, uh, you know, stop and take take small stones or small sticks that goes in without the gators. So it's very very useful thing. Um, as my socks, I have Injiji socks. Also, I have a second pair of Injiji socks in my in my uh, backpack. And for the sleeping, I'm using uh, Silver Light uh, socks. Also, as a potential backup socks for if uh, both of the Injijis are wet. Usually they dry very fast, so usually my Injijis are my go-to socks. They're being proven well on the previous trails, and uh, uh, with them I have absolutely no blisters. They dry very fast. I can go through through the wet trails and uh, and a lot of uh, uh, water crossings, and I just go through. And they dry on the way. Within half an hour, they dry. So next, this is my sanitary bag. Inside, I have a quick drying towel. My toothbrush some uh, some uh, food cream uh, toothpaste and uh, some Vaseline I, I rub with Vaseline every night when I'm in a tent because it prevents my feet from getting uh, blisters or hot spots so sanitary Okay, this is my, this is the ditty bag, inside I have some patches for my sleeping bed, for my tent, uh, lighter as a backup for the main lighter, and the uh, compass for the navigation in the case of GPS is not working for some reason. So this is my, this is my food bag. This is a steel spoon, not titanium steel. This is my tripod for for my gas stove. Pot cozy and wind protection. This is my pot. This is 600 milliliters titanium white sea pot. Excellent. It has a top. This is my quick drying rag that I use to to take uh, to take hot pot of the stove. This is my sponge to clean after I'm cooking. Lighter. Beer as 3000 and my Primus gas can. It all goes here. So So inside my pocket are electronics. Everything electrical. It's covered in the Ziploc bags. This is a box that I use for protection of my lamp. This is the lamp that I use. Very good. On the on the low selection, it is. Uh, running on for like 12 hours which is 
pretty good for pretty decent for at least two nights of walking and using it at a campsite. So excellent. I keep it in this small light plastic box because sometimes I accidentally press on button and uh, and I run out of battery life. So this box is per uh, preventing my headlamp uh, to go on when I don't want it. So next one, this is my silver white additional socks. This is my power bank, Nightcore 2000, carbon one, very light, with a power delivery so you can quickly charge it and you can uh, also, you can uh, quick charge my mobile phone. This is additional lamp this is a US lamp, very good thing, uh, I like it because it has a focus beam and I plug it directly into the power bank and use it as a, as a lamp when I need a stronger focused beam. And it's good to have a backup for the night time. So this is my backup lamp. This is a charging power, power cord and small adapters that I use together with these charging power cords. This is ACR Rescue Link Beacon satellite device that uh, allows me to call for help. If something happens and I'm in an area where there is no GSM signal out of reach, I'm using this one to call for help. Excellent stuff. Don't go into nature without it. It can save your life. So, everything else I'm keeping in waterproof construction bag. These are my slippers, very light, weighs like 80 grams. I'm using it together uh, with, uh, with plastic bags on my feet uh, if, the, if the camping spot is uh, wet or, or it's raining. This is my sleeping pad for the winter time. This is Thermarest Neo Air x very warm pad. This is L, L size. This is my puffy jacket, down jacket that keeps me warm in the morning and uh, in the night time. I also use it on cold nights. I use it uh, um, to sleep in this down jacket. This is my kilt. So far it's been very good. This is a flame screed kilt. It has special baffle construction so it's warm. I would say it is warm until like uh, minus seven. Okay, the underwear I use are ex officio boxer briefs, quick drying, very comfortable. Uh, my backpack is UL3, very light backpack. I think it weighs. 902 grams. These are my long johns, military, very light, 150 grams. This is 
my Degatlan Merino wool. Long sleeves shirt that I sleep with. So this keeps me warm in the cold nights. I, uh, I always use uh, some kind of separate layering for the for the sleeping time. I don't use my day daytime clothes. So these are my down slippers, down shoes, down socks. They're excellent if uh, nights are cold. So this is my trichology pillow. Be comfortable and that's it. That's my setup for Croatian Long Distance Trail 2021. I hope you like it and uh, wish me good luck with this. See you on the trail! If you like this video, click the like button and subscribe to my channel. See you next time!